my sound off. Make sure you guys can hear me all right. You can. Uh oh, I can't hear a thing. <laughs> my on my end, I don't know if it's just dead quiet in game. I went to windowed mode. Maybe that was a bad idea. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, you guys might hear something for a second. Hold on. Come on. Our youth to the days come and gone for the age of oppression is now nearly done. Did my headphones die as soon as I started? <laughs> What's going on here? Hold on, we are back in the meanwhile while I fix this out. I will fix this. I'll go ahead and tell you a few things about uh Ooh. here. Let's change ah headphones. There we go. You got it? Maybe? Maybe not? Oh, we're at 100% volume. Okay. <laughs> well, all right. we're starting off with a little bit of a slow one this, this today. Hold on. Let's unplug. And try one more time. Let's try to get this going. There we go. Plugged in headphones. Yep. All right, let's give this a shot. Can I hear anything? Oh, I can hear it. I don't know if that you guys can hear it now either, too. All hail to oh, Ulfric, singing came out of nowhere. <laughs> oh, here we go. All right, let's run. Let's go. Now, I have it on window mode, so I did a few things. That's partly why it's all getting a little... I get... Their voice carries really well. I can hear them from... Are they above us? You shouldn't be home in bed. Whoop. There we go. But this land is ours. Oh, there they are. We'll see it white clean. Of the Let's go out here. Okay, I don't know which way's out. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Let's leave. You are the high king. There we go. The good thing is we're actually back now for it to work. So the thing is, is we basically needed to work out a plan. The problem ultimately came down to is we just don't, we haven't been working out a plan. And so we've been kind of almost basically ignoring the mod. Uh, the mod to do survival. Which is a bit unfortunate. So we need to really fix that. We need to really fix that by actually kind of focusing a little bit more on it. Because if we don't, we're going to run into a, a bit of a... Well, exactly what's been happening. <laughs> so let's focus on survival. We're here for survival anyway, so let's do it. Oh, you know what? I realize why everything's being funky. Wait one second. Alright, I think that we got it now. Hold on. You're gonna notice a noticeable, you're gonna see a noticeable difference in just a second. I think we got this. Tech support stream this time. <laughs> Hold on, there we go. Yeah, it looks a lot better, you guys, huh? There. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Lot smoother, lot smoother. It's probably a little rough early on. So. <laughs> It, it's just a it's just something to get getting used to with the we're just dealing with the new games or not new games but switching a game every day we just got to make sure that we remember our setup <laughs> so hold on let's see uh, let's make sure that's coming in good on you guys side okay a little bit slow it's a little bit a little bit laggy on that side but it should adjust on my end they got a lot better so it should get on it should get a bit better on your end too all right, what we need to do is we need to get an axe. So we need to find a wood cutting axe. There's one in Riverwood, I'm, and I don't believe there's a guard in Riverwood right now. So I'm gonna actually try to go there. Need a ride? I can take you to any of the Tire your carriage. Where do you want to go? 
Uh, Fall Creek is pretty close to Riverwood, if I remember. And I, at least I think. White Run is a no. We are way too. Well, I mean, I guess we, we went to right run, White Run and we just started to run. That would be okay. Yeah, let's go. Don't look. Do charity. No gold, no rise. Wait, what? It's an old city. I can tell you that. Hold on. Oh, oh I didn't have a. Place for I don't have a. Dark elf, a news carriage. To live to can I have the money? I guess we don't have the money. Hold on. Let's go. It's an old city. I can tell you that. The I'm talking to them again. Oh no, let's back away. <laughs> okay, so we need we need to make some money real quick then. Oh, wine just sitting out here. Oh, is that an axe we can take? Oh, please tell me. Oh, no, it isn't. Oh, we're getting chilly. Can I cut wood without an axe? No, I need an axe. I was wondering if anything changed with the mod, but it looks like that stayed pretty much the same. So now we're, we're kind of stuck here. We're a bit stuck in Windhelm at the moment. And we tried running and seeing how far we could go out uh, before hypothermia gets you. It's not very, uh, let's just say it's not a very optimistic outlook. We're going to be in some real trouble here, I think. We should sell some stuff, I guess. Maybe a potion of brief invisibility, a few things. Try to get our way out. We can eat a stew, though. Because we were very hungry. Okay, that, let's go and see if we can make some money so we can buy our way out of here. Helm. Let's try running and talking to the store owners a little bit. I think there's a pawn shop around here. I don't know if they still call them pawn shops in this, but general store, I guess. Oh no, that's a that's a different house. What about um this way? There's gotta be a store nearby. <laughs> there's just gotta. It's a big city. It's gotta have something. Some kind of store. Let's run this way. I'm not sure if the Nieces Corner Clubs actually sell stuff or not. That's actually something I'm kind of curious about. If I could find a blacksmith, which I think we stumbled across, we could be. We could possibly find. Can I make an axe? Iron. Wood. I just want a wood cutting axe. I wish I could make one. That would be really cool. It's a shame we can't. Because we need camping supplies. Basically, we've been avoiding the camp supplies and things like that a lot. And I think that that's kind of hurting our gameplay a little bit. Where is everybody? Everybody's gone. <laughs> Everybody's disappeared. Let's go in here. White, the white file. I think we talked and got a quest from this guy, too. Yeah. I'm so close. Just a man's life work is all. Oh, if no, I this is new. I the location of the white file, but this doting busybody won't let me get it. I'll tell you where to get it. I can get it for you. you I mean, if you tell me where it is, that? I can get it for you. It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help an old man. It's buried with its maker, Corral Mill, in a long forsaken cave to the west of here. Corral Mill was a crafty one. Even in death, you would need the skills of a master alchemist to reach his resting place. Luckily for you, I've already made the mixture. Here, take it. Please, don't, don't dally. I've wasted enough time arguing with my useless assistant here. Okay, why is the file so I've used to? My entire I mean, so important to you. It brought me all the way to these frozen reaches from the warm embrace of Somerset Isle. Entire years spent in libraries, seeking out tiny villages with local legends that contain but a whisper of a hint of the file. I even named my shop after it, hoping that it might attract anyone who had heard of it. And now it's within my grasp. But the eight, it seems, <coughs> have chosen me for their amusement. <laughs> for in my current condition, I'll never be able to lay my hands on it. Hmm. 
What is the white file? Legendary bottle, forged in the days when Skyrim was just starting its turn to ice. A small container made of the magically infused snow that first fell on the throat of the world. <laughs> you were hungry. <laughs> it is said that the file will replenish whatever fluid is placed inside of it. For an alchemist like myself, it is the most pure expression of my art. To create from nothingness is... poetry. All right. Well, let's talk to his assistant real quick. It seemed like he was a little upset with him. No offense, but you're not looking so good. Are you feeling ill? It doesn't matter what I believe. Norellian does. And it might be the only thing keeping him alive right now. Okay, why do you work for Norellian? Are you kidding? I came all the way from Cyrodiil just to work with him. He's... He's not the best teacher, but... Just watching him, I've learned so much. Okay. Until next time. We got an alchemy lab here, which we could use a map anyway. I wonder if I can actually buy stuff. No, I can't buy anything from him. Ah, that's unfortunate. I was hoping to sell some stuff. And all the vendors are gone. Man, we're in just some we're in some dire straits, aren't we? We're in some dire straits trying to find a way of getting back to our just a survival focus here. Let's take that nightshade. Uh Okay. Seems like someone else got it worse. <laughs> okay, what happened here? Another girl killed. This is Susanna from Candlehearth Hall. Served me a drink just a few nights ago, but I can't say I knew her. Another? Did this happened before? Or let's, let's ask that. Susanna's the third. It's always the same. Young girl killed at night, body torn up. Are the murders being investigated, or sounds like the guards aren't doing the job? I'll just say, ask them to be investigated. as it is with the war. Nobody has the time to spend on this. Not pleasant, but it's the truth. Could you use some help? If you want to help, ask some of these gawkers if they saw anything useful. I'm going to examine the body before the rats can get to it. Uh, well, I mean, maybe we can get some money this way. So we'll talk. Always sad when someone has to die. You did it, I'm sure. <laughs> Always said when someone has to die. Yeah, that sounds like you did it. Sorry, I thought I saw a fellow running away, but didn't get a good look at him. The Imperials think us all lawless. I'm on to you. I'm proof all right. of their ignorance. This is a shame. Helgear, did you see what happened here? Uh, no, sorry. But I did notice that her coin purse was still intact, so whoever did this wasn't after gold. I'm going to keep preparing the body, if you'll excuse me. It's a fine house, and it's up for sale. Did they just talk to me in the background, the guard? Uh, did, are you one of the people who saw this, or no, no? Okay. And so does the unseen. Another one. Terrible. Did you see what happened here? I heard a scream and came running, but she was already like this when I got here. You've got some time. Stop by my house of curiosity. And you're advertising? <laughs> Did you, okay, you said that right over right over this dead person. Okay. Um, I'm sure no one will mind. My sister and I once traveled the world. <laughs> I mean he's advertising over a corpse. If you could do that, I could pick the corpse's pockets. <laughs> Let's run. Oh, the guard. I need to talk to the guard. I, I think the guard might want me to say something. My heart goes out to Clan Shattershield. Kin murdered. Family Warhammer stolen. There is no fairness in all that. Just like always, nobody saw anything useful. The bastards escaped again. Spare coin. Yeah, ma'am. May, there may be more to this if, I, if you'll let me help. Look, friend. If you think you can do better than the Legion of Guards, be my guest. You'll need to talk to your life, though. We can't just let anyone go around claiming to be an official business. If he's willing, then we'll talk. Okay. Well, technically, we just got enough money to leave, though. So, let's... Let's get deputized, I guess, first. <laughs> and then leave. 
We'll get deputized, but then we'll disappear on him. Let's run up here. I'm pretty sure you're least the steward. Also, they have food in here, so if I need to eat... It's literally setting out for people to come and eat. It's funny that it's saying it's stolen. I'm not much of a strategist, I steal. but Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. Okay, so I've heard about these murders. What do you do for the Jarl? What can you tell me about Windhelm? I grew up here, cold as at Mora, but that just grows the beard sticker. Lots of history in these walls. We're trying to make some more. It's a lucky time to be alive. We can, what do you do for the Earl? For Ulfric? Well, nothing official. Known him for years. He seems to value my thoughts, and I'm grateful for that. I don't really have a mind for war, and I think he likes having an untrained opinion from time to time. Excuse me? I've heard about these, these murders. These are difficult times indeed, when men stalk their brethren like beasts. My men are stretched thin as it is. If you offer your aid, I gladly accept. The guards will be told to assist you as necessary. I'm happy to lend a hand as much as I can as well. Okay, so we'll head out. Let's go ahead and get to the... Well, should we investigate the crime scene? I wonder, should we? Should we or should we just kind of enjoy our time of trying to learn how to survive? If I can't find a general store, we will. Just because that means I can get inside, like, these buildings every once in a while to warm up. Because we're freezing to death intermittently. Waylon Lalu. Turn up over here. Ethereon. I wonder if this guy does. Hold on. Do you sell stuff? Apparently, some Nord women were murdered. Not sure why I should care. I mean, if murder is going around, I mean, that's kind of important. <laughs> None of that matters to me. Until someone takes a Dunmer, I'll let Windhelm deal with its own problems. Uh, what can I learn about the ma- uh, about more about magic? I don't care about that. Um, what have you got Take for sale? Look. Oh, can we sell stuff then? Oh, can we only sell- well, I would sell the wine, but the wine still gives us food. A little bit, but not... Mm. But it also gives us stamina. You know, I want to sell it. Just because it's a, a decent amount of weight. And we'll have to go on our own. Jug of milk. Huh. I'd never seen that in this game. Need another drink. Let's go. Let's get our let's get a move on toward I guess asking where the murderers are? I don't know. I feel like half of me wants to go and try to actually find an axe so we can actually work on this camping stuff. Because if we don't, we're gonna be basically freezing to death wherever we go. At the same time, we do wanna work out a way to get a house. The easiest one would be the white run thing, I guess, but that's not going to be really available. At least I think. Let's go ahead and eat a little bit. I wonder if Riften would be easiest. I'm actually kind of curious which one would be easier. I don't remember what Riften's quest was for the Jarl. Right. I'm trying to remember which one was the easiest Jarl quest. I'm gonna actually try to go. I you know I'm gonna go to. I'm gonna ignore these guys and just go to. I'm gonna go, and try to, go back to Riften maybe, and get a home there, because I think I have to do the Civil War to get, a home here. I'm almost certain. I mean, maybe the murder quests will be enough, but I think you have to like, do a primary quest and then help three three more people. There's no glory in war. It's just something they Not really sure, but either way, we need to we need to work on survival. I can't keep playing the game like it's normal because we we just freeze to death when we're not paying attention. So, 
We're gonna have to actually go. Because we're already we're we're getting hungry again too. We need to go back to somewhere uh, warmer and get uh, an axe and kind of kind of demonstrate the survival stuff the a gods, little bit. I'm diseased. Hold on, I'm diseased. I didn't know. I forgot about that. That's not good. Am I diseased? Oh, hunger, fatigued, and tired. I don't have. I don't have a disease. Food poisoning, I guess. That, if you consider that a disease. I guess the guards aren't just aren't just aren't uh aren't uh aware of the survival mod. <laughs> Let's go over here. I wonder if I could take an axe off somebody too. Need a ride? I can take you to where do you okay. want to go? Okay. Now that we took some money, I'm pretty sure we have enough money. We can also do Markarth. I'm gonna do. I wonder what Riften, the Riften quest is. Riften's gonna well, be I'm warmest, so I wanna go there. At least I believe. I mean, it's the, one of the more Never south areas, southern areas. That's funny, he was just talking about the Khajiits, I'm surprised, like, I'm surprised that he didn't know about them earlier. <laughs> He's talking as if he'd never seen a Khajiit before. Let's see. Now we do have this ring, which I actually forgot to return, but it's not not it doesn't have any features to it, so there's nothing really no reason to really give it too much attention. We could also cook a little bit, which would be nice. Sacks of flour. I'm gonna eat a little bit of that, just so I'm carrying less. I'm gonna eat some potatoes too. We have way too many potatoes compared to like salt piles and the rest. We're gonna try to do the main quest for here so we at least get a home and then, or, or at least find a place that we can buy an axe. Oh! Why is the screen fuzzy? The screen is fuzzy! I, ent I entered the door but the fuzziness didn't leave. You know how it kind of gets fuzzy and stops? It stayed fuzzy! My character went through the door and gained myopia! Isn't that my, I, I, more, myopia is short-sightedness, right? Isn't that short-sightedness? Heed my words. The return of the dragon. But I don't, I don't, technically, I don't know if this would mean we're short-sighted or far-sighted or no-sighted. Deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. Put down your flagons filled with your. Oh sure. Which order message? Ah, well, I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest breeding horses in Skyrim. He agreed to sell. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. Okay, sounds easy enough. Good man. You won't regret it. Head to the Riften Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Riften. You'll be well paid for your time. Uh, why don't you go tell I'm them not yourself? Exactly though? Exactly comfortable around guards or jails. Definitely not when associates of mine have been locked up. No, I'll meet you outside of town. Okay, and why is Sibby in jail? No idea, but whatever he did, it must have angered Maven. No guard would lock up a Blackbriar without the old lady's permission. All right, let's go. <laughs> I'll meet you outside of town. Hold on. So, I don't. I was hoping that going through the door was going to fix the problem, but it doesn't seem like it has. So I'm kind of worried. Hold on. Let's go through here again. Maybe it fixed. No, it's still all fuzzy. Hold on. I'll try going all the way out of Riften. I don't know what what it is that caused all the fuzziness. So I'm going through this door and trying to move, maybe. The loading screen. Alright, is it less fuzzy? If it's still fuzzy. In Riften, I think. Alright, 
Need a ride? <laughs> it's like so slightly fuzzy. I don't know. We're, we'll just continue on. I don't know if it's enough that you guys can see it on your end. I can check real quick. Doesn't seem like it's enough to really be noticeable to you guys. But if it's a little fuzzy, I apologize. I don't know what's causing the fuzziness. Let's do actually a setting real quick. No, system. It'd be a system and... Maybe it's the depth of field went all, cra all, all crazy. Let's turn that down. No, it's still, it's, oh, it's bad. It's bad. <laughs> What's going on? How can the Why is it so fuzzy? Today? It's all fuzzy. My character's losing his eyesight. <laughs> Hold on, let's go here real quick. There's an apothecary in town. Let's wait here real quick. Down on the lower walkway. So stay sharp okay, they're talking way. to me up there. Okay, hold on. I'll try something real quick. I'm gonna try... Here, we're gonna save. Okay. Now, guys, I'm gonna... You're gonna disappear for a second. While I try to fix this. <laughs> Here, uh... Let's see. If I turn this off, I don't know if it'll... In the stream, it's capture specific window, so I'll leave that open. Hold on. Let's see if it it's closed. Okay, so I'm still on. So you guys, you guys don't. Okay, let's play again. Let's try. Now I do have the. Oh, I caught. You guys might see that I do have the online mod, but I'm not using it I'm mean, because you have to get into the online mod, the Skyrim together. Let's go in here. Skyrim together, you have to get on to through its own little harbor thing. So I don't think that I had anything to do with it. I didn't think about doing Skyrim together. Ah, it's still fuzzy. It's fuzzy. Everything's fuzzy. In the moth? Hard to believe, isn't it? Hold on. Is it is it actually my my? Is it because I'm tired? Hold on. Is it actually is that intended? Is it intended feature? Hold on. Let's also try to do one thing. Hold on. That might be an intended feature. And it's saved with it too. Save on character menu. Don't know what that means. Either way, let's go to system. Where is general quest? No, where's options? Settings. There we go. Let's go to gameplay. Not audio display. Try the exact opposite side of the spectrum here, and see if the depth of field got any better. Talos bless you, my huh? Everything is like so fuzzy. What's happened? It happened to my save. It's actually save specific. We might have just a short stream today. So if I back up at all, it's like everything goes depth of field. Let's go to none. Yeah, it's all fuzzy. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's... Am I imagining that? But it's going like real fuzzy. Am I losing my eyesight? I'm looking at my hands now. <laughs> I'm like literally looking at my actual real life hands. And trying to see if I'm like holding it the same distance as the screen. Oh my gosh, maybe I am. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm gonna I I'm gonna because I don't wanna I don't wanna torture you guys with it being fuzzy like that. I I, guess, I think I'll just end the stream a little early. You guys know our priorities now. We'll probably what sell something real quick today. Repair, purchase. Uh, I would like to. 
You seem quite, quite proud of your work. Generations. I owe my success to my forefathers and their recipe for flame. The secret is my forge. It consumes fire salts, a strange mineral that burns as hot as red mountain lava. Oh, that's actually something we need. Well, for cooking was. warm stews. Sadly, this forge is dying, and I've used the last of my fire salts. If I can't feed it soon, it may grow cold. I wonder if talking to him will fix it. You will? Thank you. Ten pinches of fire salt should give me all I need to bring this forge back to life. Okay, where can I find the fire salt? Metronox's body might provide fire salt. They're dangerous creatures that can be summoned by wizards. Of course, it would be much easier to check with an alchemist. They occasionally have them for sale. Okay, so I can't buy anything from you. <laughs> Nothing like the smell of a white hot blade. Really? I can't buy anything from everybody. What's going on? I don't know. Is it? Is it? Is it, that I, is it literally that I'm? It's all fuzzy. It's all fuzzy. We'll have to see this one. We'll save here. We'll save here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. It's been a bit of a short one. Not intentional, just a, a tech issue. Since today's been marked with its tech issues. <laughs> so, we'll, we'll save. Hold on. We'll take one good look left at fuzzy, at fuzzy uh, Talvrin here. As we say goodbye, thank you guys for watching. Sorry about the, the weirdness of this. I'll try to find out if it's also just the survival. Like, if it's actually from being tired, our character, like, is everything fuzzy. I don't know. I don't think that's actually intended. But uh, I'll see what we can do. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. i see you all later. Alright, bye!